Tries to roll through, securing that right leg. Very nice escape by Aguilar. He's leaving himself. Oh, if uh, Nardu can get that left leg through, he's leaving himself open for a triangle. He needs to pull Aguilar back down. Nice right hand through. And trying hard to drive his left shoulder through and pass that guard. <laughs> and uh, Nardu's corner seems a little frustrated that, uh, or maybe that was Aguilar, that he was putting himself in that much danger. It did seem funny. He was prime position for triangle choke and just sitting there almost relaxing and waiting to see what happened. And Nardu Deborah doing a great job of defending, not, not letting Aguilar score big, big shots. Unfortunately, he is letting Aguilar score a lot of smaller shots, which have got to be piling up the points on the judges' scorecards. Now, this is not the type of strategy that's going to win fights. Work it. Let's work it, gentlemen. Work it. He's got to try his best to stand up. And here we go. This is going to help him out. And this is part of Bodog Fight's high action mandate. Even if there is action going on the ground, if there isn't consistent progress being made toward finishing the fight, referee Troy Wah is going to stand them up, get them back on their feet, and get the fight cracking again. 90 seconds, a little bit less than 90 seconds left. And Nardu, I think, is down in this fight. He's got to make a move. He's got to press the action, steal this round in the last remaining minute. There we go. That's a start. He's pretty much, I think, shown Nick Aguilar everything that he's going to show him. And now Aguilar's starting to time his attacks, now having Nardu's number. Oh, oh. Head kick glances off Deborah's head, and he's in trouble. Scrambling on the ground, but absorbing shot after shot. And referee Troy Waugh steps in. This fight is over. And it's Aguilar showing great versatility. And showing, hey, I've got some stand-up too. And I'm here and I mean business. A valiant effort by Nardu Debra. They are uh, checking him now. Again, the utmost concern here is the safety of our fighters. And there you see the sportsmanship that only Bodog fight is gonna bring in. Here's Troy Waugh with the official verdict. Good, very good fight, both fighters. Four minutes, 27 seconds in the second round. Referee stoppage, winner. And there it is, folks. Nick Aguilar is our Bulldog fight winner, defeating Nardu Debra in the second round by TKO stoppage. He's going to go on to fight Vladimir Zanin in the Bulldog fight pay-per-view match. Don't you dare miss that battle. Don't go anywhere, because there's a lot more to come on Bodog Fight. Not happy with it. Um, it's fast and furious, you know. I just caught a couple of shots. He knew how to avoid. A lot of things in the guard, he stayed really tight, keep his head, you know, center, and uh, he avoided some submissions. He felt, he felt really strong inside, um, really strong base, um, keep his distance on the feet. And what I was hoping he would commit more with some punches, like a counter punch. I found every time I attacked, he, he moved away, there was a lot of space in the ring found myself resetting. When I reset, that's when he would clinch or shoot. So the space is good. And it sounds like it'd be bad. Didn't wait go the way I wanted to go. He won. 
my performance overall I wasn't pleased with. I was real tentative on my feet. I don't know if it was this the day or what, the nerves, you know, because of the camera stuff. I don't know what it was. Um, he's a tough guy. I, I truly think I should have had it over in the first round. I didn't throw anything. I didn't do anything. Second round, I kind of came out there. You know, I expected to do more ground and pound on him because I thought he was better on his feet. You know, he actually tied me up pretty well, and I didn't get enough off. And on my feet, I realized is where, you know, I could take him out. And, I don't know, I just felt slow and sluggish, but you know, the fights happen and I ended hard, so no complaints. Yeah, I do a high kick that caught him, but uh, my knee actually hit him. So it was kind of a, well, it meant to be a high kick, but he kind of came down. I don't know if he was gonna punch or maybe half shoot. So my knee actually hit him in the head. And then, uh, <laughs> you know, I seen him stagger back and it still took me a second to wake up. You know, and finally I hit him pretty, pretty good right hand. I knew he was not stupid. And then uh, you see a guy like that, you know, you finish him off, you just go to work on him. So, I mean, the stoppage was good. He, uh, he was falling back then. And I think actually the right hand to hit him afterwards, he was really dumb, or, uh, you know, not really stupid then. Bodog fights. The winner, Nick Aguilar, earns the right to fight Vladimir Zenin on our big pay-per-view event, USA versus Russia. This has been Bodog Fights.